A few moments ago, I was watching the soapbox. And on the soapbox was this big old ball of hate, this big old ball of racism, this big old ball of bigotry, this big old ball of evil on TV, running his mouth. Been doing it all day, all last night, all yesterday, and we'll be doing it all night tonight. And I was just sitting there looking at him, and it hit me. This man should be exiled. He should be put out of the country somewhere on a desert island by himself so he can't infumigate and disease and cause sickness and, and evilness amongst people. You need to be separated. He's like the guy that shoots a gun on the street, killed by five or six people on the street, and you separate him from the public. Donald Trump is the same kind of guy. He needs to be separated from the public. He should not have the liberty of walking around, human beings, being on TV, spewing all this hate and all this racism and all this stuff that's going to cause all that danger in this country. He should not be permitted to do it. And he's only permitted to do it because he's white. And guys, he's white. Now, wait a minute. That, I said only. That's not true. It's more than that. He's white. True. But he's evil. He's evil. That's why he is permitted. He is more evil than the guys out there shooting the guns. Those people going out there doing what you call drive-by shootings or just out there with their guns shooting, what I think every other day people are getting murdered. Donald Trump is worse than that. These people out there shooting, but they're usually shooting because of things like what Donald Trump says. They've already heard that someplace else, and he's still spewing it. He's spewing it. He's more dangerous than the guy with the AK-47. He needs to be exiled.